It's time. We have to have an honest and frank discussion about the bluish question. Because I am tired. You know, I've played trading card games my entire life. And I enjoy them most of the time. You know, I played Magic the Gathering as a kid. And I, I played it with some of my friends in prison. And it's a great way to sort of have a, a nice little circle of friends. And you, you have a, a good time playing card decks. And then, and then a blue player comes along. Every single time a blue player does something to the landscape of the game that makes it not fun for everybody. Because blues, they leverage control over the supply of mana. Have you ever, have you ever noticed this? You know, where, whatever game they're in. I'm not playing Magic right now. I've been playing Elder Scrolls Legends, right? And blues have no sense of actually building a functional board of their own, right? It's all about shackling and stealing attacks and being subversive and, and just using up as much fucking time as possible. The, the blue player is always the one when they're losing, they'll just get up and let the clock run out, right? Just to have that, the, if they're winning, right? They'll have one spell in their fucking hand. They'll have one spell in their fucking hand and they'll play 30 others before it. You know, you know what I'm talking about, right? Every, every time, only the blue players do this. You know this. It's never the other players. So there's an essential problem of character with the blue. And you guys, you guys know what I'm talking about, right? Like, I run an honest deck of Nords. You know, I get as many Nords on the table as possible, and I just, I just aggro as, as hell, right? This is a simple and honest way of playing. And if I win, I win. That's great. If I if I lose, I I don't I don't mind losing. And I know I know what these blues are gonna say, right? Oh, you're just mad. You're just mad because you get run circles around you by bluish players, which is not true. Which is not true. I win more effectively against blue than many other deck formats. That's not the issue. That's not the issue. My, the real counter to my deck right now is white green. In this in this format in this meta game, like the the Imperial Roman stuff, they spawn all these little creatures, right? They get a Mondas Stone on the table. Like I have a hard time winning against white green decks, but it's just, it, like if I lose to these decks, it doesn't take like three fucking hours, you know. And always, always the blue will come in. And they have this style of play, which is like they're rules lawyering, right? There's all sorts of layers. It takes forever, you know? And like, it's all about freezing every single asset that you have on the board and never letting you get anywhere. You know what I'm talking about. Everybody who plays trading card games knows about the nature of the blue and how they leverage their supply and their control over the international mana supply to make every game not fun. Every game, every meta game becomes about the blue. You know, you always have to, you always have to, whatever deck format you're building, you build it primarily against the blue, you know? So instead of having like fun battles that are quick, and we're not, we're rewarded per win in Elder Scrolls Legends. Like, that's a fact. You don't get anything. Like, I could have 20 battles against non-bluish players, right? And even if I had a, a, a lower win rate, because I'm rewarded per win, like, like, since those battles don't take that long to resolve, I get more at the end of it. I've built more. I've, I've risen in rank more. I've got more rewards. And then I go up against a bluish player. And, he, you know, I'm, I'm probably winning because, like, my deck format is strong against the blue. It's a very Aryan deck format. Like, I run Nords and Orcs. And it just takes a fucking hour. They make it take an hour every fucking time. There's no sense. And, and you know, eking out rare wins in a way that takes a fucking hour. What the fuck is wrong with bluish people? I will stand eternally against the blue. The blue 
is sick. The blue is degenerate. The blue has brought the decay of subversive combat techniques and board control to our good community, and we must ban the blue. We must expel the blue. The blue must be removed from every trading card game format that we know of on the earth. That's what I think, and I think you all know that what I'm saying is correct, right? Nobody wants to say it. Nobody wants to say that the blue is the problem, but the blue is the problem every fucking time, and we've got to get rid of the blue. Thanks. Hail victory.